Rashad. Welcome back to the King Size Life channel. If this is your first time clicking on my video, thank you. You should definitely think about sticking around, subscribing. You're getting some cool things over here. If you're returning, thank you as well. Let's get into the video. So today I'm doing a styling video. It's gonna be a black and white styling video just because black and white is probably my favorite thing to wear of all times. Like everybody loves getting black. Literally, everybody loves getting black. But once you add white to it, it gives you some dimension and you can be more creative with your outfit making. So that's why I like to wear black and white. So I got about six outfits. I have six outfits. So for this first outfit, I did my black Boohoo Sherlin coat. And I did the Balenciaga white um, graphic tee underneath. I paired it with my uh, black slim cut Levi jeans. I prefer the slim cut over skinny cut. I just feel like it works better for my body type and personally my body type. And I normally go with the slim over the skinny. I did the uh, black ASOS chunky um, boots, lace up boots. They're dope, they're comfortable. Probably one of my favorite boots to wear this winter anyway. And I just topped it off with my black and white chrome hearts hat. It was a vibe, it was chill. A very simple outfit. Okay, so this outfit, I did my black Shockerware t-shirt, which are great quality, like they're the best t-shirts. They don't stretch out and get all drunk on you after one wash. They, they're quality, like they literally have lasted me like two, three months, like same t-shirt. So. I suggest you guys rock with the uh, Shockerware t-shirts. I did the um, black H&M overshirt, wool overshirt over top of that. I um, paired that with my minimal um, black, um, brain fart, uh, black leather moto jeans. I did those with it. And then I added my black, white, and gold um, Jordan ones that I just got that I'm low key obsessed with. <laughs> and um, I just added my, um, added my Michael Kors messenger bag and my Versace shades for a little razzle dazzle, you know? All right, this outfit, I did my black Shockerware t-shirt again, and I topped it with my, um, my new minimal tweed shirt. I did it in black and white, and it's fire. <laughs> it's fire if you ask me. Like it's black and white tweed and it has like silver stitching like inside of it. You probably can't see it in the video, like in a clip that I'm showing you right now, but in person in the light, it's like, it kind of like sparkles a little bit and it has like the um, fabric hanging at the bottom for added detail. It's fire. I think it's fire. Um, I did my black Levi jeans. Slim cut jeans again. And on my feet, I did my um, a black chunky boot from ASOS. Bottega Veneta inspired or dupe, whatever you, each, whatever you want to say. They work better. And this one is an OD but goodie. This jacket was my jam. Like probably like three months ago, three years ago, I'm sorry, three years ago was really my jam. It's um, a black and white moto contrast jacket from both sides, right? All black or AUL black. I'll link them below. But this was like my favorite jacket. I love that jacket. I, I mean, as you can see, it's fire, right? <laughs> but um, I did my that jacket. I did a black Zara basic T-shirt underneath there. I did some um, some dad jeans from Target that I left the hem out on the bottom of. Um, they have like that old school, like kind of flared fit a little bit. And on the feet, I did um, a pair of Zara boots that I have a love-hate relationship with because the mugs hurt. They hurt, like hurt, like real bad, like real, real bad. Like it feels like the equivalent to me walking around in a six inch hip. So I don't know if I'm gonna actually be wearing those, we'll see. I like the way the outfit came together though. It looked pretty dope to me. So, um, I mean, y'all can let me know what y'all think. 
or not. I don't know. Um, but this was the outfit. I did my Versace frames with it. The black ones. They go with everything. Here I did a black chunky turtleneck from um, H&M. For the bottoms, I did um, black minimal snap snap um, pants. Um, on the feet, I did those same chunky Bottega inspired boots. I did the ASOS. Um, I think it's ASOS. ASOS. Yeah, ASOS uh, snake snakeskin fatty pack. Did that across my chest instead of across my back and my waist. Um, and I did my white Versace frame. They make me feel like I'm from the future. <laughs> All right, so this last fit, I kept it simple for the most part. I did a black crew neck sweater from Target. I did um, my black H&M slim fit jeans on the feet. I did my, um, oh, those same boots that I told you I hurt my feet. And I put it like torturing myself in. I don't, I don't get it. <laughs> but um, later on, I added a coat. I added the black and white houndstooth coat of mine just for some drama. It's perfect when you're wearing all black like that just to add like a pop of something on top of it. So, you know, when you walk in the room, everybody like, you know, who that, who that, who that, you know? <laughs> <laughs> That's all I got. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I enjoyed being here with you guys. Stick around, subscribe, like, comment, show me some love. Thank you. <laughs>